Commander, this'll be a two-pronged assault. First, we hack the heart of the Advent Tower and disrupt their network, but we'll have to move fast. If we can seize control of that data, Shen's cooking up a little surprise for them that should more than get their attention. Lock it down, secure the surrounding area, and remove all enemy security forces guarding the target. All goes well, they won't even see us coming. Greetings, hello, and welcome back to more Long War of the Chosen. We've got our second network tower here, which is probably going to be a little bit spicier than the previous one. 16 to 18 enemies, so we're very likely to have a group both at the bottom and on top, and then three, maybe four groups roaming outside, depending on how big the groups are. Three groups would make it easier uh, to, you know, walk around all of them. Also, we have apparently some new map layout with the a building on the bridge. At least we've got some high ground for a sniper, I guess. Let's migrate over there. Well, I'm curious to see how this shakes out here. Okay, let's have let's get Chris come over on the right. Anyone out there? A heavy mech. Okay. Hmm. So ideally, I want you, I guess, up here. But this group, of course, we need to kind of dance around them. No. Sort of, man. I think I need to watch where they're going. So normally, I would, in a normal network tower mission, I would um, I would expect them to not cross this this line, right? This, this first bridge line is usually where they don't cross, but... So if they go into the building, which they seem to do, then I think we're gonna try to sneak past them on the right. Especially since I don't see the mech right now. Let's get crazy. Uh, what's this? Okay, let's not overwatch Chris today. Don't see the mech, so I don't know the detection tiles. Um, ah. snell, snell, snell. Yeah, yeah, very schnell. I don't trust this map layout for now, so I'm just gonna fall back a little bit. Now watch him turn around and come out again. Oh, an officer with a bunch of troopers, and there's really no way to pass them on that bridge. Gotta make those old noises. And we have groups of three, so there's probably four groups total out there. Like how the second guy kicked the door open, the mech's like, no, 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 I can, can just face through this. Don't worry about it. Hmm. There seems to be some sort of building they're heading to. Like, if I can sneak past them, then it should be fine. Ah, I'm kind of happy that I'm not sitting there anymore.
that is on a, again on the old maps that would be a line they never cross like in almost hundreds of network towers i've never seen a unit walk past this line and on this map they do it so gotta learn those new maps i guess Yeah, I'm not sure I like that. The question is how far how far will they come? Um I actually gonna you hate it when your trigger finger gets all itchy. Okay. If you need me, I'm gonna overwatch I'll be all of them there. Ooh. Now the alternative is to do a, a crossover here. So we have, what, this is two different groups, right? One group with the drone, one group with the Viper. And then we have the officer group here. It depends which direction they go, but, you know, crossing and, and getting to that building might be a viable option. Trying to go somewhere where I'm not going to be stuck until I'm revealed. And we have options to run back to this side of the bridge. How far back is Chris? I think should be far enough to get out of there. Hmm. Okay, the drone is coming over there. I don't think I can get to that. That detection range probably until here. Said that bridge seems smaller than the normal bridges. Um, excuse me. Where's he going? Okay, um, well, not okay, but, uh, yeah, that just happened. Oh yeah, yeah sure, go and overwatch. It's fine, see if I care. That is not a not a bad idea. Let me just see. What can you shoot? You have a shot on the sector, right? You have a shot on the drone. First things first. Mac needs to go. Alright, if you go this way, this way, and come up here behind the Lancer. Yep. Took down another. Need some ammo. What are we doing here?
think we probably need to fully dash back. Or dash maybe inside here, where they don't have shots on me. But they... No, there's no side. Well, there's a window. I don't think if that trooper can go anywhere. I'm not sure if they can see me from there. A quick... Seven, eight, nine, 12, 17, no, that's 18, 19 tiles. That might be the option. And then you're gonna come down here probably and hack con control hack the drone. Like, the downside is, if we do a control hack, um, we have a drone as kind of a mimic beacon. We take the drone out of the fight, but they see the drone, which means they know the positions of everybody. Alternatively, we just kill the drone with the sniper shot. Or we just steady up for a good shot next turn. I'm you know what? I like that idea. Because we weren't steadied there, right? That was because we overwatched. I think I'm going for the dash back here. I like the um, stupid double moves that most of them are doing. Let's get crazy. It's a little bit wasteful, but we need to we need to start clearing up, right? Not quite the clearing up that I was hoping for here. Supplied here. Got a flank on that troop, huh? Okay. 
also gives us line, on side, line off side on everything. So we can see that, yep, that sniper position sucked. Tremendously. If I'd stayed there, I would have had one shot. Okay. You need to get that kill to get implacable, my friend. That's what you need. Need an extended mag. Yeah, that probably too. Okay, um, I think my drone friend is gonna move here and stun the grenadier. This is the move here. On yeah, let's come over to that side. Yeah, I wish I still had line of sight on this guy. So I think you're falling back here. Don't think anyone can get line of sight on you there. Let's get going. Need to dash up here. I think we're gonna aid protocol over there and then. And then also add up. Also, also. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. But getting past four groups here on that map, like even if they hadn't walked into me at my spawn point, basically, which I still feel like they shouldn't go there. They don't do that in any of the old network tower maps. Um, that's a super way to learn, and any time you learn, your time and energy is not wasted. Yeah, anyway, I'm not sure what my thought was, but um, that position here is hopefully paying off. That's a super way to learn, I guess. Yeah. Teamwork. So we have a zombie down here. I don't really care about that zombie. I do care about the positioning of the other guys, though. He's out for another turn. Sectoid is back here. There was a second sector at the officer and the trooper. trooper one trooper is here. So let's go there for line of sight. There's the officer. Okay.
Well, let's take one shot on, shot on the officer, that's for sure. Oh, we also have that... Guaranteed kill on that trooper who's in cover. So maybe we just take a shot on the officer. Come on, not now. Ammo here. I'm somewhat certain that should give me implacable. It did not. That probably means it also doesn't give me um, the invulnerability thing. Battlefield awareness. So I think I need to command, go up here, command, get battlefield awareness. Which means you are gonna do what? Uh, if I were to end my turn in that corner, we'll move over here next turn and potentially do something with that guy. So we just go back here. Sure. That zombie is becoming a little bit of an issue. Shoot the sectoid from up here. Well, either of the sectoids. Let's migrate over there. Yeah, that's that's migrate over there, exactly. And first of all, check what sniper shots we have. We've got that sectoid, that zombie. Sweet. Only one shot, unless I command again. Um, let's first check here. To get 53. To 73. Okay, that is... No, 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 no. That is, that is a good first hit. Maybe I don't care about that sectoid. Maybe I come down here somewhere. We have Lana Sard on that guy. Combat protocol, the officer. That should then also give me executioner for 
hopefully a kill. Roger. Grenadier. Forgot about the Grenadier. I don't think he'll, he'll be able to do much. Ooh, can we get a grenade in there? Can't get a shot in there. Was your best throwing arm? No. Not happening. Let's do it. Interesting down the side there. Oh, look at it. resisting all the mind stuff here today. Let's go feed these guys some humble pie. Okay, and the first set of reinforcements. Um how are we looking here? Not on the sectoid. Do we need that shot? I really want you on the high ground though for the last groups. We can go here, grapple here, and then reload and look like a fool. Um, that's probably not. We're looking. Three grenades and one more airdrop. So let's go. Let's have some fun. Let's get crazy. I need this guy to come out of his little building now. So I think you're gonna... Run Mission over here. Magazine here. Ah, I remember my first gunfight. Loud and as much as I want to get on the high ground, I think we need some steadied weapon here for that reinforcement turn. the right side. That's okay, that's my sniper side. My kind of trouble. Exactly. Good hit on that stunny. Ooh, excellent shot. Yeah, no doubt it you. Free. That's not amazing. Scout can be re really a problem. Though we might be able to just bait that with with um, 
untouchable, battlefield awareness, whatever you want to call it. What do you see? Okay, let's take two shots on this guy. No, okay. One shot then. Fine, have it your way. Kind of thinking maybe not using the cooldown here. The grapple. Need some ammo. Alright, all we need is six damage on that guy. Should have between this and then your shot, your attack, your your combat protocol, I guess. So you're kind of slow. Not sure if we saw anything in the final room yet. That I should have kept the combat protocol for, I guess, if there's a turret over there. Okay. Let's bring everything over to the right. And I think we're going for... No, we're not going for that. You're going to set up here. And if we're engaging here, you might get some flank shots. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Reinforcements is a problem. Not having free reloads here is a problem. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. Examining that area. Keep going. Strictly business. I mean, we got we got to pick up that loot, right? That is not even not even an option to I ignore think that. Position befestigt. I've taken Gemma. I could have delayed the reinforcements. Just kidding. <clears throat> now we had three guys stop in as reinforcements. What in? We had two zombies, so twelve. So maybe well, it's sixteen to eighteen, right? We could have three be below, three up top, or maybe just one group of four. Grapple ready next turn. What we can do or try to do probably is um, get the hack in when the next reinforcements drop. So we can also hack the rein um, stun the reinforcements. Gonna be. I don't see anything here, I don't see anything there, so 
This is behind both of them. Should not reveal anything, right? Okay. In technical terms, that's known as, as laziness. Watching that way. Like someone is over there. All right, reinforcements are coming in. So ideally, I want to hack next turn. You've been in bewegung. Do not spot anybody here. Interesting. All right, go inside. That's a weird pause there. All right. I think I'm just gonna sit here. Next turn I can blue move here, hack, and clean up. I guess. I guess. First of all, let me take just a moment to thank you for allowing me back into your homes. Technically, there's a chance that me moving there, put them on yellow alert, and they might come through the door. Hey, friends. You guys come here often? Ooh, where's a pretty one? He just stands out here and sparkles. Like that. I'm assuming he's not going to be stunned if I a hack now because he's in sustain. Roger. Target in range. Move to hack the command console. Joke at me. Come on. Got the hacking PCS. We got the enemy protocol, I think, earlier this campaign. We have control of the network tower. The signal is going out. Did it just say Archon is stunned? Oh, okay. Just just making sure I'm reading the right things here. Uh, you're gonna come here. I'm not seeing anything, so I'm assuming stuff's gonna be up top. I think you're gonna overwatch the priest. Um, wanna have steady weapons, so let's take that shot, death from above, and all of that. Did I give you good, good sort of? Yeah, you have Mac Shorty. Sure, whatever. Guess that works too. Good time, right? It's uh, two turns done. The aliens may have cleaned up the design, but these monsters are no better than the ones my father dealt with. Okay. Well, I will survey that area. I need some grenades up here, I think, also. Well, let's just start working. I spend a lot of time 
in the woods in a hunt. Let's have some more fun. Okay, that hits them all. Um, how do we do this? I'll reload. Magazine here. I'll take shot at the shield barrel. The results have come in. You lose. Okay. Uh, let's, I mean, double, double check where that grenade's gonna land. Okay. So, I should be able to go here. Then after the grenade, I can take a shot at the Argon. Right, um, precision shot, Archon, go. Wonderful. And we have fresh out of combat protocols here. Or anything else, really, so I guess you're just gonna take a shot. Or we could command. I think we got this. Like, I can also hack this thing next turn. We get another sniper shot. Shot here. Almost. Trying to trying to feed that kill here. I will survey that area. I'm beginning this to enjoy Avenger. this. Status confirmed. Area secure. Okay. Um note to self, uh, don't trust the the methods of the old um, network towers with the new maps, I guess. At this point I wonder how far forward they can come. Is that something you even define when creating a map, like what the petrol area is, or... Or are the, the pots just at their own device? But I mean, it feels so... I don't know. Like in the old Network Devonair Tower map, I've never seen a pot wander onto the, the first bridge towards the starting area. That would have been a hell of a coincidence if that is just randomly not happening. Anyway, we got some really good promotions. We are gonna pick up Implacable here on Paulo. For that repositioning, catching up after taking shots. And we're gonna have Disabling Shot over here. For those crucial stunts on the big nasty enemies. 
and I think good good first showing here from Xanthanos. Um, and it's it was not just um, chasing disabled enemies after the tower hack. And then the big question, when and or if are we going to do this HQ? And certainly some arguments in order to do it soon. Um, mostly doing the HQ gives me another source of income with, with four people. And then we can do full recruit again and get all the recruits instead of rebels. That's going to be fun. Um, we're also getting data pads, four or five, guaranteed from the HQ mission, which we can crack for some intel, since we're kind of lacking on that front right now. Well, either way, I think we're gonna wait... gonna wait for advanced coil. Let's just keep scanning over here for now. Gonna have this embassy in a second. Also, infirmary is ready. Staff a scientist and gonna do I remove that? It's like on paper, this is trivial, right? Just don't overwatch your your grenadier. I'm sure I overwatched him a couple of times at the end there. And it could have been could have been bad. Like when I overwatched him to get the, the priest, he could have triggered his overly aggressive, just taken a shot at whatever, and then I wouldn't have had an overwatch for the priest. Let's remove that trait. I don't care about the fear of the Chosen. I think that's something where I can avoid bringing those people on the Chosen missions. Okay. Ooh. Not very nice. Oh, yeah, there was a suggestion, um, and I think it makes sense, but for different reasons, to just train these guys as shinobis because, um, well, the suggestion was more in relation to having people for single shinobi suicide missions. Which I kind of, you know, we're not doing suicide missions here. Um, but there, there are many missions where you just need some shinobi in concealment for, for scouting. And that can be a squaddy, that's fine. Like, that can help out in a pinch, on an even on an HQ. I, I take, if I just want somebody for shouting, uh, shouting? Shouting? Yeah, maybe shouting too, but mostly scouting. Um, I'm okay with a rookie squaddy shinobi. Together, we have succeeded in our task. Right. Ah, uh, Shen is gonna complain. I didn't. I didn't assign. Commander, our ring facility is currently idle. If we have the soldiers to spare, we should deploy them on a covert action with the resistance. Didn't assign crazy eyes to a new job after finishing their construction there. Um, right. Are we doing... No, we're not doing anything. The Proving Grounds, that's fine. I kind of wanted to see what the supply drop is going to be, but I guess we're going to do the troop column first. Got a technical, got a reaper, got a grenadier, got a sharpshooter, and we've got our spark ready to go. And we'll do that in the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you next time.